Tonight we begin a three-part special series on President Uhuru Kenyatta's legacy project running all the way to the first of Wednesday as Kenya celebrates Madaraka Day. Our sign language interpreter is Byron Abuli, our socials at KBC Channel One, at my Twitter handle at Tomboya24, and the hashtag is Prime Edition. Straight to our top story, the presidential candidate registration exercise entered its second day Monday with Umoja Summit Party presidential candidate Walter Mongare becoming the first candidate to be cleared by the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission. IBC Chairman Wafule Chabukati says that three other presidential candidates who have so far presented their papers for clearance were rejected due to the signature shortcomings. This comes as Usawa Kwawote, party presidential candidate Mwagi Wa Iria's effort to seek audience with IEBC over his rejection failed, as Kamche Meza reports. Presidential aspirant. Walter Mongare for Umoja Summit Party is now ready to hit the campaign grounds after IEBC on Monday cleared him to vie for president. I did the checklist, and uh, based on that, uh, we commission will issue, uh, I as returning also for presidential election will issue a certificate. Mongare, who has been issued with a certificate, says it's a win for the youth. This is not about a personality, but it's about the issues that affect us as a people. And many of you know that for a very long time, I acted as president, and I want to say that <laughs> Moi is back. It was, however, not a lucky day for Roots Party flag bearer Professor George Wajakoya, whose application was not successful after failing to provide supporters lists from 24 counties. We are going to do it because you have seen, witnessed, that we have passed everything. <laughs> Apart from one thing, anago kadogo tutafanya hivyo. Na mungu akijalia, tutakutana tena. Wajakoya, however, has until 2nd of June to rectify the shortcoming. Earlier at the Bomas of Kenya entrance, Osawa Kwawote party leader Mwangi Wairia put up a show demanding audience with IEBC chairman Wafula Chebukati after his name missed out on the final list of presidential candidates. We have the documents. They signed documents for 24 counties. Yesterday morning, they released a list. All of them were caught. They have all been aligned. The only name which has been left out is mine. Accompanied by his supporters, Wairia camped outside the gate for hours, saying he has been shortchanged. Mimi na soma horotha, si mimi siko kwa horotha. Wanataka niyote, 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 then they say, I'm time bad. I've told them no. Mimi mewabia, mimi ndaku hapo, kwa hiyo, kwa hiyo barot. We know the cause, I know the cause, you requirement of contesting as a president in Kenya. In the case of Mwangi Wairia, the... On verification, the initial verification done, he had only complied with five counties out of 24. And that is on that basis that uh, he was uh, not invited to come for this registration exercise. And those records are here, uh, which uh, I think can be shared with the media. Chebukati, however, says disgruntled candidates can file complaints with the commission. The commission takes a two-day break before resuming the exercise Thursday. Kamchemenza for Prime Edition.